So there is a 100% free AI image to video generator out there, which is much, much better than Kling AI and Minimax in terms of speed, pricing, and many other features. So yeah, I'm talking about Tensor Art, which is an amazing platform, which contains different models for image to video generation. And yeah, the best thing about this is you can go ahead and create videos out of that without any logo, without any waiting time. And speed and quality of this AI video generator is absolutely amazing. Amazing. So yeah, without further ado, you guys, let's jump right into it. All right, guys. So first of all, if you come into the homepage of Tensor Art, so you guys can see we get lots of various models, which include like image generator models as well as video generator models as well. Uh, so yeah, you guys can see we get lots of other options as well. So you can browse in that, uh, like all the way from flux as well as stable diffusion. But today in this video specifically, we're gonna go ahead and search for the alternative for Kling AI and Minimax AI because as you guys know, like in Kling AI, uh, the subscription Description has gone very very expensive and if you talk about minimax like halo ai so yeah in that you get only three generations and in halo ai the wait time is literally hours right so yeah uh, let's just go ahead and test out this free ai video generator in tensor r so for that uh, in the home page we're gonna go ahead and go to this one which is make your pictures come to life uh, so you're gonna click on this spongebob icon model so you're gonna click on try from here and this will direct you to a very very a basic a very intuitive design in which you guys can see we have now make your pictures come live so this is basically an ai image animator right so you can give a bit of animations to your images that what exactly the image to video model does so yeah uh, so you guys can see we have a few of the samples that people have created out of this ai tool so if you take a look at this video so yeah, you guys can see the video looks really, really good. And you know what's the best thing about this AI video generator is you don't get any logo in that. So yeah, that will be completely free. And the Tensor Art, specifically this tool is going to provide you 50 credits every single day, right? So that will be pretty much enough to generate up to like 10 to 15 generations. And these credits are going to renew every single day. And you know, that is literally amazing, like how beautifully uh, you can go ahead and create all these generations generations like you'll be totally free and there won't be any watermark any logo right so before jumping right into this tool let's just go ahead and see some of the samples that the community have created with this particular model so yeah take a look at this video right over here in the star so you guys can see we have a very slight animation over here so yeah this is some kind of a uh, avatar so we have a very subtle animation in that looks really really accurate only we have a little bit problem in the fps but other than that no logo whatsoever the aspect ratio is really really good and yeah next video take a look at this animated video of an anime so yeah uh that looks really really good the way uh you know the clothes are moving in the wind and everything is working out that looks really really amazing you guys and the next one like wow this is absolutely amazing like take a look at this video like the animated video of a monkey uh you know so all these generations these were created from images right so yeah without further ado you guys let's just go ahead and test this out right now so over here you guys can see we have a very intuitive process so first of all you have to input your image then your prompt and in that we only get two to three options and then you have to simply click on go in order to start your generation okay so yeah that simple is it so first of all I'm going to go ahead and start off by providing in an image of a human portrait. So this is what it's going to be. So I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop this image into my image box. And in the prompt, you guys, mind you, a very important thing. So over here, unlike Minimax and Kling AI, you have to be really, really accurate, really, really descriptive with your details, right? You cannot just write over here like animate this image or, you know, like girl moving his head or something. You have to be very, very descriptive. So for that, we're going to go ahead and take help from ChatGPT. So I'm going to provide this image into the ChatGPT prompt box and write in my prompt, like have this image for image to video generation. And now give me complete detailed prompt for having slight motion in this image so yeah chat is going to basically provide a long prompt for us which will be really descriptive but we will have subtle emotion into that right so yeah from here we're going to go ahead and copy this prompt come back to uh, our tensor art and just paste it right over here and from that make sure you have this enhance option turned on okay so what it's going to do is going to basically enhance your prompt more and more in order to get you know better and better output out of your input right so yeah uh once it's done so yeah now let's just go ahead and click on go in order to start our creation 
So you guys can see it's saying uh, our generation is only going to take around 30 to 120 seconds, which is absolutely crazy. Like, you know, how quickly it's going to generate unlikely and Halo AI will take a light to 15 or 20 minutes as well if you are on the free version. But yeah, you guys can see there is no queue at all. Uh, your generation will start straight away, right? All right, so once it's done, here is the output it came out with. So yeah, wow, this looks really, really good. Like, take a look at how beautifully everything is working out. You know, the way here is uh, blowing uh, because of the wind. We have a cinematic, ultra-realistic close-up video of a woman with auburn hair, uh, freckles, green eyes, the way she is, you know, just smiling. She's moving her head. Uh, she's winking. Everything looks top notch in that just we have a slight bit of problem. The resolution is not good at all because if you take a look at our image, so this was our initial image, which was super, super highly detailed. And for that, uh, the result is not that much detailed, right? So yeah, for that, what you can do is you can go ahead and upscale this video with the help of any video upscaler. So according to me, the best AI video upscaler that I can recommend you guys is Crea AI, right? So yeah, first of all, you're going to jump into the homepage of Crea AI. In that, uh, you get the option of AI image and video enhancer. So you're going to click on that. Just simply upload uh, your video and after some time, after a few settings, it's going to go ahead and change your video from this to this. Like, take a look at this, how beautifully it has changed our generation and now our AI video looks really, really good, okay? So from here, I'm going to simply go ahead and download my result. So this is the final output, you guys. So now, let's just go ahead and compare uh, this tensor art result with the good old famous Halo AI just to see like how much we can get that kind of output from tensor art as well. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and jump to our homepage of Halo AI. And yeah, right off the bat, I'm going to go ahead and upload my image. Uh, copy the same prompt that we created from chat GPT. Paste it right over here. Now, let's just go ahead and create this. All right, and after some time, this is the output it came out with. Yeah, uh, first glance looks absolutely top notch. And now I'm going to go ahead and download this one. And let's just go ahead and compare both of the outputs. So, yeah. All right, so on left, uh, we have the generation from Tensored Art. And on right, we have the generation uh, from Halo AI. So, obviously, uh, you know, right off the bat, the Halo AI looks really, really good. Uh, but the Tensored Art after upscaling is very, very good as well. Because, you know, there is no logo in that. There's no watermark. You can go ahead and try these for free and post it anywhere, right? Like, now it's totally your creation. But Halo AI, you know, it provides a better FPS, a uh, better output, you know, like better had moments and overall the video looks very very pleasing to me of halo ai but uh the tensor art is not far at all the outputs uh it provide is really really good as well you guys right so now let's just go ahead and try out with some cartoon characters so i'm gonna go ahead and take uh this image of a cartoon character all right i'm gonna simply go ahead and drag and drop this into my image box and in the prompt, again, we're going to go ahead and take help from chat GPD. So yeah, a prompt for slide motion in the cartoon character here is our whole descriptive prompt. I'm going to copy this, paste it right over here in my prompt box. Make sure again, uh, your enhance option is turned on. And after that, simply click on go. All right, so after uh, some time, it's going to go ahead and prepare these generation for us. And yeah, it looks really, really good the way the cartoon character is uh, talking. Only again, we have the similar problem of the resolution. Other than that, the motion, the everything it provide, it is looking really, really good, you guys, right? And again, we can go ahead and uh, upscale it into our Crea AI. So I'm going to go ahead and do the same. And after that, we're going to go ahead and create this creation in Halo AI as well, just to compare both of the results. So this is the output that Halo AI provided me, which looks absolutely insane, no doubt in that. But yeah, uh, just we are having this big logo in the end. But other than that, uh, the generation is really, really amazing. So now let's just go ahead and compare both of the results. So yeah, uh, clearly you guys can see uh, the Halo AI generation looks really, really good. It has more of that motion that we want but if you are looking for that subtle motion if you're looking for uh you know that nice bit of animation so yeah 
Tensor Art could be a really good option for you guys as well, okay? All right, so for our uh, last example, I'm gonna go ahead and take this image, like it's a fashion photography image of a girl. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just drop it uh, into my image box and the prompt, we're gonna go ahead and take that again from chat GPT, just simply paste it right over here. And now let's just go ahead and create this. And similarly, we're gonna go ahead and create that in Halo AI as well, okay? So yeah, take a look at both of the outputs. Uh, no doubt uh, the result is looking really, really good on Halo AI. But similarly, if you take a look at the Tensor Art, so it provides very accurate, like there's no deformation, there's no morphing effect whatsoever. So yeah, you guys can clearly uh, take an idea like how beautifully the Tensor Art is creating those animations for us and keeping that in mind you know there is no wait time there is no logo no watermark this is a really good tool out there in the market for you guys okay and lastly you guys you can go ahead and do the same for your anime video as well like take a look at this one uh this i created from an anime output and for anime i must say uh, the results are absolutely amazing right because this is the kind of resolution and frames per second that you want for your anime because this is a very old anime and specifically if you want to go ahead and play around with your anime so yeah tensor art could be a wonderful choice for you guys no doubt in that okay so yeah, there you have it guys, uh, this was the exploration of a new AI video generator that's here in the market, uh, you know, without any paid subscription, uh, without any watermark and without any waiting like queue time. So right now you can go ahead and try it out for absolutely free. Uh, you can create as many generations as you want. Obviously in the free one, uh, they would be limited in a day. But other than that, you know, the results it can create are really, really competitive, right? So yeah, I hope you like this video guys and I will see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.